Hello and welcome to a short video about my latest um, creation here. This is a short sword with about a 17 inch blade. It's got a um, 2 inch radius, I'm sorry, 1 inch radius fuller. And uh, 2 inch radius hollow grinds on the edges. The edge bars are Crewforge V carbon steel. And the two center bars are um, Merovingian twist Damascus. That would be fine layers alternated with bold layers for this particular look. The tip has got a forge welded bird's beak construction. And the Damascus in the center is Crew Forge V and 15 and 20. It's got my torch mark etched and masked off before the rest of the blade steel was etched. The guard is an interesting thing. It and the handle are one piece made out of four pieces forge welded together. It's um, not your typical A36 mild steel. It's, it's higher quality. This is uh, 1018 which forge welds nicely. This was done in a coal fire. And I got some nicely blended forge welds down to the tip of each quillen. Um, they're TIG welded together here under the collars. And on this end I did a shorter forge welded end to two of the bars. The collar is decorative, not structural, and it's made out of uh, forged silicon bronze wrapped around and brazed and given a hammer finish and shined back up. There is a taper to the basket hilt here. It swells in the middle, it's a little larger in the front, a little smaller in the back. Fits my hand very nicely. Not overly forward heavy on the balance. With that fuller, kind of lightens it up, the deep hollow grinds. And here on the back we have a bullet-shaped bronze finial nut that I turned that sits down on a shoulder and the end of the tang screws into it and it forms a fleur de -lis motif on the end of the knife by way of a pommel. It screws down, this is a, it screws off, this is a takedown and uh, through the spiral of the handle you can see the etched tang of the blade with an elongated two-bar Merovingian pattern continuing from the core of the blade. This knife was very technically challenging for me to build. I basically made up this handle construction and it barely worked out. Um, as it was, everything fit up real nice with a whole lot of hand filing. And uh, the blade itself was an excursion for me. I'd never tried Crewforge edge bars on uh, a multi-bar blade. And this also worked out pretty well too, but man, a lot of sweat went into it. Anyway, I really hope that you enjoyed watching this. Oh yes, the balance point. About two and a half, two and three quarter to three inches in front of uh, ostensibly the guard. So, not bad. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the knife.